In this video, I just kind of want to give you a heads up on some of the problems you could encounter if you use wood treads on a rock surface, concrete surface. You know, let's say you have concrete risers, um, rock risers as we do here, tile, something like that. Something where you're going to be attaching the wood to the um, to another surface besides wood. I mean, wood to wood uh, seems to work pretty good, but once you start attaching it to concrete, you run into a few problems. One of those, of course, would be the wood is going to uh, decay a little faster than the rock. You're going to have to replace the wood eventually. Now, you're probably wondering why didn't they just use rock for the steps? If we come over here and take a look at it, and I'm not saying, you know, you, could, you know, they probably could do a better job. You could get some uh, flatter rocks, but most of the time, most of the rock stairways I've came across, uh, the treads, the steps are a little too uneven and they're difficult to walk on. So um, I could see where they would do something like this. But let's just say they were looking for a design. Uh, they wanted to have a little different uh, look. You know, the rock, uh, a lot of times we'll come in and we'll have a, a riser. If it's, if it's a wood stairway, it'll be a brown riser with a lighter colored step or the reverse. So they could be looking for that also type of a look. So here we have the steps. And here's one of the problems I'd like to talk about, the bolts sticking up or the nuts, whatever they are. If uh, These are bolts, obviously, but if you uh, did it the way I would do it normally, you would end up with a nut here um, and an anchor bolt uh, embedded into the concrete. Um, so these are obviously a trip hazard. Um, it would be nicer if it was at the bottom of the stairs. You do not want the trip hazard at the top unless, of course, you're coming into the area here. Walking down the stairway, this is going to be painful if you trip on it. Now, what about the holes that are a little too deep? This could also create a trip hazard for someone, obviously, with uh, pointed shoes like high heels. Next up on the list will be the amount of debris that gets caught in between the treads. To solve that, you could always go to a solid surface. Instead of two 2x6s, two you could have a 2x12, and that would be fine. That would eliminate the amount of debris that would get caught in the center. However, it will not um, eliminate the amount of debris that's going to get caught in between the tread and the rock. Now this thing looks like it was recently replaced because this is nice and clean here. Um, here's a more of a better example of what it's going to look like in the future. So debris will rot the wood faster and um, that's not a good thing. So debris, um, the bolts, and you're probably wondering, wait a minute, if it's treated lumber, that's going to be fine. And uh, no, treated lumber rots. I have seen, I have not yet ever came across a piece of treated lumber that does not rot. I am not suggesting that they don't make it. I just haven't came across it yet. So now as a solution to something like this, you want to you build a rock stairway, you like this type of a design, I would suggest going with a concrete tread. Just simply pouring a tread that's maybe uh, two and a half inches thick, um, something like that. Um, you could probably make a, a design with um, the concrete uh, also doing it a, a different uh, way to where you would have a rock surface going up to the concrete. I will leave that up to you. The purpose of this video was just to point out as a design, give you some design um, idea, something to think about if you are going to design a stairway like this. So let's just go with the three things, quick uh, go over everything. Uh, make sure that the bolts and the nuts are not sticking up, trip hazard. Make sure that they're not uh, down. You could always fill these holes with some type of a filler or plugs maybe, but a filler would probably work better. Um, and then, of course, the gaps with the amount of debris that's going to get uh, caught in there could rot the wood faster. So as a suggestion, um, maybe you would want to go with um, concrete, use a concrete tread. Now, you're probably thinking, what about using the um, man-made materials that they use for patios? That's fine, as long as you can figure out a way to attach them to the 
concrete or to the surface without creating a trip hazard. And if you can, great, then you have uh, solved all the problems that uh, you're going to encounter for, for this type of a stairway.